What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Kevin with Kevin RC. Guys, I'm finally here. I finally decided to go ahead and do that YouTube channel I've been saying I was going to do for a while. And I must say, I'm stoked for it. Stick around. You won't want to miss it. In this channel, we're going to be sure to be covering a wide array of topics from speed running, bashing, crawling, how to's, vlogging, and unboxing. I started this hobby as just random. I think it was YouTube algorithm. I was watching a video on YouTube and I was like, it was Kevin Talbot, I believe. And I was like, whoa, that stuff kind of look cool. So one thing led to another. I bought one of those uh, cars off of Amazon, one of those, you know, Amazon specials, as you would call it. And uh, I quickly found out. It wasn't that fun, so that didn't last long. But I had that feeling like, this hobby's kind of cool. Like, let me see what I can do with this. So I figured, I'm gonna start my own channel so that way I can, you know, be another voice in the community of this RC hobby, you know, that it's fun, you know, anyone can do it. All you gotta really do is watch videos, watch stuff I'm gonna put out, other YouTube channels that are famous and big for this RC hobby. There's a bunch of resources out there. It's up to you to want to put yourself out there to learn this stuff because it's a lot to learn. But once you get it down, it's very, very rewarding. I actually still remember the day I bought my first car. It was supposed to be for my birthday, so I bought myself a Traxxas slash two-wheel drive from AMA. I didn't know really much about the hobby. I was just watching hours of YouTube videos, all these channels that were putting out content. I was like, oh, this is cool. That was the first car I got slash... I thought it was amazing. It was a brush two-wheel drive. Did no more than 30 miles per hour, but you couldn't tell me that wasn't faster than that. In my eyes, it was 50, because I, I hadn't seen nothing like that since I was a kid. So I was like, this is amazing. Long story short, got brushless and, and, and started breaking parts left and right with that car. Then I bought a TTO2, and then it just, the rest was history. Now my collection is nice and growing, and I'm, I'm loving every second of it. Got little tiny cars, got big cars, cars that'll go 100 miles per hour, and small cars that'll go 25 miles per hour that you wouldn't even believe. I'm starting to learn planes. Got me a plane, so I look forward to seeing some content on that. And I may even just get into a boat. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see. Like, comment, subscribe, because you guys will not want to miss out on this future content I'm planning. I got some pretty awesome things I'm thinking will be a hit. Things that you may know or may not know and refreshers, because you know we all can use a refresher. Whether you've been in this hobby for two months or 22 years, it doesn't matter. Some of the stuff I'm gonna put out, I feel like it's valuable to all of us as a whole. So stick around. Thanks guys.